you had Let's money that he was going to get a knockout. Let's be clear. Um, I'm an Errol Spence fan. I think he's the best. And I knew it going into the fight. I, you know, it's funny that um, a lot of people had Garcia winning this fight. And mm -hmm. I, I just couldn't fathom for the life of me how they had Marky Garcia winning this fight. Right. Um, this is what I'll say. Um, well, let me first share with you guys why I'm upset. Uh, so, you know, this happened maybe a month. I think I heard about them fighting maybe a month ago. Okay. Um, I'm at work. I'm talking to a co-worker. And um, I'm like, yeah, so, you know, you heard Garcia fighting Earl Spence. He's going to beat the shit out of Mikey Garcia. This is what I said verbatim. He mm -hmm. said, no, he's not. I said, no, yes, he is. Mm -hmm. I don't think you understand how nice Earl Spence is. Mm -hmm. He said, yeah, but Mikey Garcia is nice. No argument. Mm -hmm. Mikey Garcia is nice. Mm -hmm. He ain't Earl Spence level. Right. He said, all right. Um, the Bama says, well, you think he's going to crush him? I said, yeah, he's going to crush him. He's going to knock him out. He's going to knock Mikey Garcia out. Mm -hmm. And he was like, well, I put money that he doesn't knock out Mikey Garcia. Mm -hmm. I said, yeah, I said he's going to knock him out by the eight. At least by the eighth of the ninth. He right. said, by the eighth of the ninth? Right. He said, so if he's still standing by the ninth, I win. Mm -hmm. I said, yeah. Okay. Because I'm... I, <laughs> um, Needless to say. So it was the ninth. It was the if he, by was, the ninth. If he was standing by okay. the ninth. Okay. Then um, I thought at any point, even if it was by the eleventh, that yeah, you would still. No, no, no. Okay. He had a, if okay. he was standing by the ninth, I lost. Okay. Um, wish I would have kind of changed that bet because I ended up having <laughs> yeah, right. to buy this dude a uh, single single barrel Jack Daniel that cost me sixty dollars that I didn't want to spend. Damn. So you blew the money on the bet, plus you you know had to spend money on. What you had to get him. That's tough. On what I had to get him? You said you had to, you just bought him uh No, nah, I bought him the bottle. That was the extent bottle. of the bet. That was okay, okay. That was the gotcha, yeah, that gotcha, was the extent gotcha. of the bet. Yeah. Okay. I had to spend sixty dollars on, on that damn bottle. Mm -hmm. Um and why I'm upset is is that Errol Spence could have knocked this dude out. Mm hmm And I feel like Earl Spence went out to prove to Sugar Ray Leonard mm -hmm. that he could box because Sugar Ray Leonard had said something um, prior okay. to the fight gotcha. that Earl Spence can't box. Mm -hmm. So I think Earl Spence went into this fight saying, I'm going to box this dude and I can box this dude because Mikey Garcia right. don't take no chances. I'm going to go to full 12. Because Mikey Garcia is not going to bring the fight to him. He's not going He's going to wait to see what you're doing and yep. try to, you know what I'm saying? Right. He's gonna box you. He mm -hmm. he don't take chances. Okay. Earl Spence won every single round <laughs> of that fr of that freaking. Uh, mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, I, I saw some of the no I saw some of the numbers. He won yeah. every round. I watched it from one to twelve. Mm -hmm. He won every single round. There was a round where you heard um, Garcia's corner saying, "Hey, you got push. You got to push this." You gotta push it. You yep. gotta push it. Mm -hmm. And he tried to push it for about thirty seconds, and then you could tell he kind of got like, oh, it's like he felt uncomfortable with trying to force the fight. Yeah. And then he went right back to his, you know, trying to catch him, trying to catch God's, uh, Spence slipping. Yep. You're not gonna catch Spence slipping. You're just not. Right. And um, so he just boxed him for twelve rounds, and and um, here's why I'm upset with Earl Spence. And just my opinion, just mm -hmm. my... Just, aside from the bet. Aside from the bet. <laughs> um, this is Errol Spence's biggest fight mm -hmm. to date. Mm -hmm. and, and of course he's going to get, um, you know, he want to fight Pacquiao. And he's going to probably end up getting Pacquiao. He's probably going to end up getting Sean Porter. Mm -hmm. um, hopefully somewhere down in the next two to three years, him and uh, Terrence Crawford are going to figure it out. Right. Um, but this is the biggest fight... I think this fight more than any other fight he's had. Right. He needed a knockout. Mm -hmm. Um. What's his career knockouts? Um. I think he's only he's only been past this. I want to say that I forget what the stat was. He's only been to the twelfth round once. Okay. I believe, and this and it was this fight. Okay. Um. I think he's. I think he's only only three of his fights where it wasn't a knockout. Mm-hmm. Um, I, I don't know. Okay. I don't know. I don't know uh, one hundred percent for certain, but I know it's something crazy like that. Mm -hmm. Like he gets in there, and he knocks niggas out. Right. Right. Period. Um, and but if you watch the fight, you could tell. You saw he wasn't even really swinging like mm -hmm. like he normally like it. 
he it seems to it seemed to me like he literally went into that fight mm -hmm. with the idea that I'm gonna box this dude and show Sugar Ray Leonard that I can box. Uh, he, that he can box. Uh, thank you, Ossie. Uh So 25 and 0 with 21 knockouts. So there were right. four fights where he, he didn't knock the dude. Got, okay. Okay. Um. Um. <laughs> I. I know it's just in my small world mm -hmm. having dominant knockout fights mm -hmm. in these types of fights mm -hmm. is important to me, and I think I think when he goes to fight the Terence Crawfords and the Sean Porters, mm -hmm. people are going to harken back to the fact that he didn't so, knock out right so, at, uh, Mikey Garcia. And, and try to like pin that against his right. who he is as a fighter. So my question is to you: the the knockout is important because it adds to the build up of to the, the next the next opponent. Fight. Because this was for me, this is kind of like this was like his uh, his gateway fight. Mm -hmm. I don't see him fighting no scrubs after this. Sure, sure. I don't. I just don't see it. I mean, I don't see him fighting no scrubs after beating Mikey Garcia the way he beat Mike Garcia. Mm -hmm. So. I would have liked to seen a knockout, and that's like, that's my, my, my introduction into the bigger fights. Right. I knocked out Mikey Garcia, and let's be clear: if you don't know, Mikey Garcia is a fight like he is a strong fighter, mm -hmm. and I think he just missed the opportunity with that. I just think I just think he missed the opportunity with that. So let me ask you a question. Mm -hmm. So. You mentioned Terrence Crawford, Manny Pacquiao, some of the names that could potentially be Errol Spence Jr.'s next opponent. Manny Pacquiao is definitely happening, I would think. Okay, um, that, and that's cool because yeah. I, I think Pacquiao at this stage and Sean career, Porter is definitely happening. Sean Porter too. Yeah, I think Manny Pacquiao at this stage of his career can still box to a certain level. That's not Spence what he once bang. was. Errol Spence is going to bang, but he's going to yeah, he's, he's going to knock him out. Bang. But you got to take a Manny Pacquiao fight because Manny Pacquiao has been on a on a run. He's sure. been on a tear. What? Do the people want to see? Do they want to see Errol Spence versus Pac, or do they want to see Errol Spence Crawford. versus Crawford? Yeah, Crawford. Okay, that, that, but okay, but he, but he hasn't had enough big fights. To, in my opinion, mm -hmm. he hasn't had enough big fights to be jumping from Mikey Garcia to Bud Crawford. Okay, so no, he's, gotcha. he's got to fight. Because my thinking yeah. is, is hey, look, you one of the best. I want to see you go up yeah, against nah, the nah, best. Nah, 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 nah. He got, he got to fight some. He got to fight some, mm -hmm. some big boys. But my, but my line of thinking was right. You know the people. The people want to see Bud yeah, yeah, versus yeah, yeah, Arrow yeah, yeah, yeah. over. Yeah, yeah. Arrow yeah, clearly, versus clearly. Man. But yeah, but he got he got to, he got to go through Sean Porter. He got he got he got to go through some. Mm -hmm. He got to go through some fights. That I think. I think yeah.